country music has lost a legend. Jeff Cook died peacefully at his Florida home November 7th with family and close friends by his side. He was 73. Jeff's musical journey began when he was 13, playing lead guitar and keyboards in bands. He felt right at home behind the microphone, whether it was singing or spinning records at a Fort Payne radio station. Jeff and his cousins, Randy Owen and Teddy Gentry, started playing together more than 50 years ago. They spent summers in the 70s playing for tips at the Bowery Bar in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Their dream of signing with a major record label finally came true. They left here on July 12th of 1980. I was very proud of them, very happy for them. Victor Shama runs and owns the Bowery. He talked about the loss of Jeff. He was just an extraordinary guy to get to know and to know him. He was on that, that stardom never really hit Jeff Cook. When Jeff wasn't on stage, I'm rolling. you could find him in the recording studio he built at his home on Lookout Mountain or at a lake fishing for bass. Five different governors named him Alabama's fishing ambassador. Maybe some mountain music. The group reeled in 43 number one hits and sold more than 80 million albums. He was the guy that, that coined the, the phrase, ain't having fun now. Yeah. When they would be performing, even back in the club days, and, and the crowd would be going, hey, going crazy. He would, ain't we having fun now? And they never wanted the fun to end. In 2012, Jeff was diagnosed with Parkinson's. He stopped touring with the band in 2018 because of declining health. But he told his cousins, the show must go on. Teddy it tells his story and it's, it's true. He said the one agreement that they all agreed upon, Randy and Teddy and Jeff agreed upon was that we will never ever use the word quit. And I float on down the river. They never did. And they never have, and they never will. Southern born and southern bred. God bless you, thank y'all. Their music will live forever. We love y'all, thank you. Jerry Hayes, News 19.